What is going on, guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about how the community has been kind of mixed when it comes to the way that Zoss has decided to handle content going forward in 2023. I made a video about this a few days ago talking about how they're going to go away from what they have been doing over the last several years. And this is not unusual because what they've been doing over the last several years was not always what they did in the past either. Uh, I've been playing the game since it came out here on console, and they've changed the way they've done content several times. And I was expecting a change sometime soon because it's just kind of how it happens. Every several years, I would say three, four, five years, they're going to be looking to change the way they tr try to do content in the game to keep it fresh and keep players coming back and keep new players coming in. Uh, of course, we're going to have one story zone this year. You're going to have your big story zone with more story, and you can do it from start to finish. Of course, they're going to have a maintenance period in one of the quarters. Also, the dungeons like normal uh, in one of the quarters. And last but not least, the thing that a lot of people are worried about is the new system. Because I think some people feel like that there may be just a take on adding things to what we already have when it comes to dungeons, four-man content, trials. They're just going to add some new stuff to that. But uh, kind of in that uh, letter that the director wrote, he talked about adding something in the game that people have been asking for for a really long time. And the two things that most people in the community are looking at is going to either be spell crafting or overland difficulty changes. And that is something that people have asked for a lot. I would say spell crafting has been asked for for a really long time. Overland difficulty has been something that's been talked about over the last couple of years. And I think both of those would be a big thing. And this would kind of compare to what we would see when we had the antiquities added in, maybe housing added in, to where instead of being paired with you know, content when it comes to a story, this is going to be something they're going to do just at the end of the year, and it's going to be a new system added into the game. And I think if that's actually the case, they're going to add something like that, it would be a massive change and a massive improvement from the way they have done content over the last few years. Now, if it's changed to where it's going to be something that's not as uh new or not something that is not as exciting as this and it's you know kind of just adding stuff to what we already have to exist or what we already have with our existing content players may not like that as much but i think if it was spell crafting or overland difficulty which a lot of people have been talking about hoping for i think those would be uh two things that people could really get behind when it comes to that quarter four new system idea uh spell crafting i think is something that like I said, it's been talk, talked about for a really long time. Would it work well in ESO? We kind of have to wait and see. Maybe that's why it's taken so long. Maybe that's why we haven't had it in the past. It's taken a long time for them to get that correct uh, to work in game. Or overland difficulty. Now, I think if they do the overland difficulty idea, they're going to have to change the way that some of the gear drops or something about everything. Because if you're playing on a very difficult overland kind of experience, I think the reward should be better. So if you're out and getting, you know, Mother of Sorrow and you're playing on a really hard difficulty in that, you know, specific zone, I think that Mother of Sorrow's gear should have an extra bonus to it, something to it to where it wouldn't just be like the regular drop because what would be the point of, you know, the difficult content besides just, you know, it being harder and it not be as easy to just run through. So if they add some things to the gear, add some things to the what you get when it comes to drops in these overland zones, I think that would be a big, big improvement as well. But leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this new content system. Let me know what you think the quarter four new system would be and what would you like it to be if you had your choice. Anyway, guys, if you liked the video, hit the like. If you hadn't subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.